guess that makes you a real deviant. V. Just V. Only people I know real well get to use my real name. But we'll get to know each other well in no time, honey. Sure, why not? Do what you do best. I know that you're dying. Listen, I'm looking for someone who worked here. Evelyn Parker. Know her? Know where she is? You must see the big picture. You focus too much on details, minor ones, like Evelyn. Please don't act like you know me. I just want some answers. But are you asking the right questions? How can you change what has already happened? Got only one right question now. The one I asked. Where's Evelyn Parker? Why'd the manager say she didn't work here anymore? When was she last here? You know anything? These are questions to which you'll find the answers on your own. I was told this place would fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting, this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them. And beyond. So what's it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died once already, only to face another kind of death. Not about to come to terms with shit. The fact I'm dying's an incentive. I'm running from that, living it up. You wish to leave something behind, a piece of yourself. That's why this all began. You wish to be remembered. Yeah. Wanted to reach the top. Be someone. Still do. But seems like that might not happen anymore. Still. If I gotta die, I wanna go down in history. Fuck it, even a footnote would do. And after that? Do you think death is a disappearing act, followed by exactly nothing? People I've lost live on in my thoughts, and that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just some stranger's voice in my own body, yapping away. Mm, no longer part of the world. You will still have an impact there. So you believe death is not the end after all? Reassuring. I think I might just be afraid. So I imagine these things to distract myself from the thought of the void. If what I saw before is any indication, I... You are sensitive. That does not make you weak. Try to suppress your emotions, and you'll drown. So, where do we go from here? This is the part where I tell you what you must do. Oh, okay. Be my guest. You've never backed down from anything, so don't stop now. Not one step backwards. In this city, people die on their way to the corner store for a scop pop. But that threat's never stopped you. You dive into the middle of it all. Always have. Things are moving way too fast. Around me. Without me. I... I can't keep up. A minor delusion. The truth is, we and our paths are braided. Never ending. Ever transforming. Not being, but becoming. And what's happening inside you, it could change the world. Listen, V, never look back. If you must kill, kill. If you must burn all the world to the ground, then let it burn, okay? 
Thanks for this. I... I don't want to go out there. No one ever does. But eventually, we all must. Afterlife. What... what happened? You interrupted the session? Did I do something wrong? Were you not satisfied? Had all kinds of things going on in my head lately. This was... different. Refreshing. Yes, that is what we do at Clouds. Think I get why people come here. Come back. But I came for something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Wait just a sec. That's not how this works. You can't ask me about the dollhouse or anything like that. I could get in serious trouble. Go. Please, just go. I need this info. Name your price. She's not here, and I barely even knew her. That's all I can say. It'll be worth your while. Try to remember. We're not supposed to accept anything from clients. Everything goes through the shift bosses. I, I can't just... Nobody came looking for her. Nothing out of the ordinary happened? There was an... incident... with a client. I don't know the specifics. One doesn't ask about these things around here. Tom might know. He and Evelyn were close. Go ask him. And please leave me alone. Where'll I find him? He's a doll here. Works the VIP area, booth two. Thanks. Shh. Don't ask for me again. Ever. Not bad, but it would be much better. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am! No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog! I'm taking it up with you! Here, now! You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This gonk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there! From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay... I know it. What will you have? Anything? You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much. Even for me. Hi! Um... I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. Be Relax. Like... You don't need any data, don't need any deeds. I'm not a customer. Here to talk. To you, specifically. Not to be with the doll. Tom, is that it? Uh-huh. Need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. Mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Osaka or Oslo? Which was it? Uh, uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman? Who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. 
Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Clients allowed in here. Well, dear, close the door on the way out, would ya? As you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho bitch who's never been ghosted by her bill or bow before. But go on. I'm listening. You've got info, I've got Eddie's. It's a fair trade. What's your price? You need to pull your head out of your ass. Eddie's will buy your horse here, not snitches. I look like either of those to you. Told you what you looked like. Don't tell me you weren't listening. Surely a reasonable man like yourself wouldn't mistake a donation for a bribe. Clouds is under Tiger Claw control, isn't it? It's none of your fucking biz. Guessing you heard about Jotaro Shobo? Uh, Shobo had an accident. What Shobo had was a very unfortunate meeting with me. Just happened to be his last. Wouldn't want this to be your last meeting, would ya? Of course not. Never wanted to be anything like Shobo. Girl you're looking for, Parker. She ain't here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. But you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their job's to generate profit. Evelyn stopped pulling profit? No denying that, sadly for her. Her chip was busted up pretty damn good. By who? A client? No, outside job. Some kind of crack shot net runner. Punched through our ice like it was cheap wallpaper. Girl was a vegetable. Believe you me, we tried to fix it. Didn't even come close. This you talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, he said he knew something or other. You invested your own eddies to help poor, unprofitable Evelyn? Please. <laughs> you got me. Ripper's the one who paid me. For a broken doll. People got all kinds of kinks. Trust me. I know, considering where I work. Fingers is a real specimen, though. Got all the fetishes. Even the ones you've never heard of. I'm sure he found her a nice niche. <laughs> Anything's better than a bullet to the brain. <laughs> you know, that's what every doll says. I'm starting to like you. You looking for work by any chance? The Ripper. An address. Don't know her last name. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? Look there. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. Quicker you're out of here, the better. Dark fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co-ed's wet dream. <laughs> 